The FDA will be notifying physicians that the use of acid. Well, let's see how we say that. Acetaminophen. Acetaminophen. Hi, it's Dr. Newman, your doctor in the family. Recently, President Trump suggested that Tylenol or acetaminophen when used during pregnancy may cause autism. However, this claim contradicts the entire consensus of leading medical organizations and scientific studies. Did you know that there was a comprehensive study done of over 2.4 million children that found no association between using acetaminophen during pregnancy and autism? They also did a study with siblings that showed no increased risk of autism, ADHD, or any other intellectual disability that's linked to using Tylenol during pregnancy. It's so important to rely on evidence-based information when you're making health decisions for yourself and your family. I think I can say that there are certain groups of people that don't take vaccines and don't take any pills that have no autism. Is that a correct statement, by the way? See, Bobby wants to be very careful with what he says, and he should, but I'm not so careful with what I say. If you have any concerns about medications during pregnancy, please consult with your healthcare provider, your OB. And remember that self-advocacy means asking questions, reviewing credible evidence, and making informed decisions in partnership with your care team. That's how you protect both your health and the health of your baby.